Hi guys, I have an Aldi grocery haul here and I just went to Aldi, I don't even know, maybe last week, but it just seemed like I just went in there. But I, this is Weight Watchers, I joined Weight Watchers, um, their new program called Freestyle. And so this section down is, I won't say all of my food, but Weight Watchers friendly food and then the rest I'll show you because um, I watched a lot of videos last night on, and I can't even remember some of the names, but some of the videos on Weight Watchers uh, food. I did first watch um, The Green Notebook Erin, and I know she's on the program, and I'll make sure I'll link her video down below. She also like showed what she eat in a day, in a day or in that week, and then um, her progress as well. So I'm going to put this on this other channel. I know some of you know that I had bariatric surgery. I'll be post-op two years in October this year. And I kind of um, at a plateau or really kind of didn't really super super really try um, keep going and I feel like I need that accountability to get on that scale I always love their program to get on their scale every week and because I have the sleeve it should be easier for me um, but this whole process if you're on my other channel thank you guys that have subscribed to that channel because it has grown and I haven't even put any videos over there but thank you for joining me over there so I'm gonna just put this with this channel this haul I don't know going forward what else I'll put on this channel but I'm at the point now that it, it doesn't even matter which which channel I put it on so let's get started with this because we're gonna run to the gym and time is ticking okay so I spent like um, I put the total down below because I had to do a separate transaction because Jason told me don't go over 100 and he already knows that I will. He knows I'm hard-headed like that. So I paid for some of it. He paid for the other. So let me start right here in the middle. I'll do Weight Watchers first and do the family next. Okay, so I picked up some whole wheat pasta. And when I say Weight Watchers, stuff that I plan on eating with the plan. So it's not totally... Um, 100% healthy like for this for example the chocolate flavored syrup so on their Weight Watchers app they have a quick start section which I thought was great because I haven't been to a meet and I signed up for meetings and also um, online so I didn't quite know what the program was about because they're they're always changing it but I like this program I'll talk about that at the end <laughs> I like this program and anyway so they have a recipe where it is chocolate syrup with some low sodium peanut butter on an apple so um, it's only like three points I don't remember how much but again as well for the points I will put that caption below because I'm new at this this is like I just signed up like last night so I also picked up some real bacon pieces and I don't know how many points this is, but I will use this for my family and for myself if I make like an omelet or something. But I know eggs are zero points. Hot sauce is probably a zero point item. I picked up some of this bread. I've seen a couple of people haul this, but I have not. I don't eat a whole lot of bread, but I just wanted to have some just in case if I wanted a sandwich so I don't have to mess with their bread. Um, again, the whole wheat spaghetti. I picked up the Fit and Active 100 calorie snack packs. I picked these up before when I was on Weight Watchers. This is the chocolate chip and also the baked chocolate wafer snacks. And the chocolate are really good. Both of them are good. Um, I also picked up some Diet Coke, the Festi Cherry. I wanted to try this when they had it at Walmart. You can buy one can in at a time to try it. Uh, but I said I'll pick it up today because I know that I look likes love soda that's my weakness so i picked that up to have that so i won't mess with the regular i also picked up some 94 percent fat free butter popcorn in case i wanted something salty or crunchy and i don't know how many points but i'll look it up to see i should have looked it up in the store how much it is and that's a great snack with some hot sauce so i remember my mom used to have that a lot of times when she was on, I don't know if it was Jenny Craig or Weight Watchers, can't remember. The unsalted almond milk, 
unsalted, unsweeted almond vanilla milk. I picked that up for smoothies. And then I picked up the light reduced fat ranch dressing. The large cooked shrimp. I already have some. I have some tilapia already. Two bags of that. Um, ground tur turkey didn't have the kind I normally get. I already have some of that. All of that is zero points um, depending on how reduced fat it is but it's zero points I picked up some spring mix they didn't have it in the organic or in the tub I normally get some spinach I'm going to separate this and put it in freezer bags for Jason so he loves his protein he has protein like twice every day so I picked that up for him some cilantro it's a recipe of that and I don't remember what it is but I have it in my recipe book and I'll show you that guys too the romaine heart some lemon for some lemon water i've been hearing a lot of youtubers talk about the lemon water and on instagram um i think i was watching Paige danielle's video and a couple of times she mentioned lemon water and then in her so i wanted to try that lemon water as well picked up some romaine hearts these were not romaine hearts some roma tomatoes and these were 149 the cucumbers were 49 cents I also picked up some zucchini. It was $159 and some grape tomatoes. These were $149. The packs of chunk light tuna. I just made some today. These are $0.85. Cents. I usually like to get the can because if I'm making it for the whole family, it's more economical to do that. Because I think they're like $0.64 cents than to do this. But if I'm making it for myself, um, I do like tuna, but I hate draining it. So I picked that up. As well, I wanted to try this peanut delight natural creamy peanut butter because it was less in sodium. Actually, the organic is even lesser in sodium. It's like 45 versus this is 75 and the regular is 140. So the organic was like 339 and this was like 129. But the last time I had some natural peanut butter or Jason tried it, I was couponing a whole lot and he didn't like it. So I'm hoping that this is not terrible. I'm really hoping. Also, I picked up some red grapes. Um, the Crunch Master Multi Seeds Crisp. I picked these up a while ago. I don't know if I showed you guys. These are from Walmart. You can get these at Walmart. So they were just here because I had some earlier trying some. Um, those are good. I know they told us in my bariatric meeting to pick those up. And then I seen someone talk about it in their Weight Watchers haul. So that's what I was going to say in case I forget. Is that I noticed with this new plan that it's really how I'm supposed to eat most of the time. And I am supposed to be limited to, I would say, 40 grams of protein. 40 grams of carbs in a day. Maybe a little bit more because I'm a little bit further out. And... Uh, about 90 grams of protein a day so I'm noticing how watching hauls and food prep and so forth and how everything zero points I'm like this is nothing but low carb or the way I'm supposed to totally eat with um, the vertical sleeve so anyway I also picked up um, these pretzel rods because I saw this in Danielle's haul where she paired or she said you could use this with the pepper jack Happy Farm, so I thought I would pick that up in case I wanted something crunchy and salty. And then also I picked up the garlic and herb, which I picked these up um, before when I was doing Weight Watchers. Some red delicious apples for Jason and whoever else wants some. I like the green ones. Some balsamic vinaigrette. Some low sodium um, soy sauce for a recipe that was on a Quick Start app. And I'll share that too. I picked up some chicken tenderloins, some chocolate fudge bars. These are probably compared to the Weight Watcher ones. And let me put this in the fridge. I think this is the first time I picked up the Fit and Active Cheddar Cheese. This is the mild. And I don't think you get quite as much as the other one, or maybe two cups in here. Um, but I can't remember the price. And then also the reduced low fat moisture mozzarella cheese 2%. So I'll try to go back and look at the prices and add the points for you guys. Some mixed vegetables. This is as well. They didn't have like frozen carrots and peas for the, what was that? I think it's a quick 
shrimp fried rice yes that's what the, this is for and this so it doesn't bother me that string beans are in there so that'd be fine i picked up a small pack of the 90 percent lean extra lean ground beef and that was five dollars for that little bit but i got it um as well i didn't see the potatoes that was in danielle's haul but i saw these yellow potatoes so i said i'll try those the bananas they were super ripe mainly got them for jason or the kids there's my green apples i think i was watching so many hauls i was trying to subscribe to whoever i watched and the um parmesan encrusted chicken tenders someone mentioned these and i had these before so i wanted to um pick those up again also the pepperoni turkey as well I like the regular I can eat the turkey but I'll try the regular and the feta there was a salad on there with feta cheese so I picked up the feta cheese reduced fat for that and then I picked up some onion, oh, onion oven roasted turkey breast the fit and active and then this was like $2.49 each in the Honey Ham Fit and Active. Then I also picked up some bacon. You guys know I love my bacon. So I already had some bacon, but I said I'll put this in the freezer so I won't have to keep making trips. And I have to look up how many points they are. Um, a lot of people, when I saw their hauls, they did haul this particular kind, which I already liked. Um... I saw this also in Paige Danielle's haul, the light butter, because I needed some for, um, just for them to have for, what am I thinking about? They had some barbecue bread at Dollar Tree, and so I, we used to eat that all the time growing up, and we didn't have, I ran out of butter, so I needed some of that. I picked up two of the spring water, and then, try not to go too fast. <laughs> Let's see. I also saw this in the Weight Watchers haul where the English muffins, I don't think there are that many points. So, I, English muffins, so I picked those up. Then the rest of this is everybody else's. I picked up some hot dog, hot dog buns because I grilled a lot of hot dogs the other day on the grill for the family. And I should have gotten them some chili too. Some split top wheat bread and the white bread and i just been going to these you guys know i usually get honey wheat or whole wheat because uh, josiah likes these better and they're cheaper i don't know guys um i shouldn't do that though garlic salt some crushed tomatoes that should be over there but it's really everybody's just like this is um concord grape jelly um popcorn jj loves popcorn i haven't picked it up in a while but i was picking up the low fat so i said i picked that up one percent chocolate milk some orange juice i should have picked up two because they'll go through that like water some creamy peanut butter this is the big thing my lights out over here it's getting dark um some syrup i should have got the light syrup but i really don't use the syrup too much i picked up three i haven't picked up pizza in a while three of the four meat original pizza and their cookies and cream they're on their last little bit so i picked that up for them and the tandow concentrated bleach i like to get the concentrated and that's it guys let me show you as we got to go this is the mini recollection planner and i picked this up i thought i always liked the recipe books but i didn't want the classic and i didn't want the big one because i already have a big one and i wanted a small one to for my vsg recipes there's a bariatric group on facebook a really big one and they put recipes on there they have a website and i just wanted to have them at my fingertips so now i'm going to put my weight watchers um, meals in here as well and that's why i got it so today sasa today um i started with the it has a meal planning tab and i just even though i may switch these meals up i just started writing some in so the shrimp and black bean tostadas i was writing really sloppy um ranch chicken salad and quick shrimp fried i think that's for, so be fried rice and so i did do the little shopping list. I didn't check it off while I was in there. But I did the shopping list. And I think it's really, really neat. You can put your week up there. And I probably should have got one for the family too. But I'm not carrying two books in the store. 
but this would be great for myself so one page is weekly meal planning and these are $14.99 so you can use a 50% off or when they have a 60% off coupon and get it that way or when it's on sale 40% off with an additional 20-25% and get it dirt cheap like that because I don't pay regular price and this is excuse me sorry y'all the inventory for your pantry that's really neat because a lot of things I already had like brown rice and the meats and stuff and I just did a mental inventory before I left but if you write it down you'll have it and then here's the section for recipes and this fits so perfect in my little purse today and then they have like a some stickers back here in the bag so that's super cute um, and I like that the little ring bound so again it was originally $14.99 and I think that's it guys that I wanted to say thanks so much for watching as always don't forget to like comment and subscribe let me know if you want to see more Weight Watchers um, hauls or meal prep or whatever just let me know <laughs> thanks guys bye bye